What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to take a look at the Silent Hill leaks that came out earlier today and the fact that they are 100% accurate. Uh, they kind of have to be, and that's a, a big part of what I want to discuss in this video. So you have Dusk Gollum, Aesthetic Gamer. We talked about him before. There's various opinions on this guy online, and that's totally cool. I, I'm not, you know, I, I don't bow down to any of these kind of people, but I know some people really trust him. Some people think he's a fraud, you know, whatever. At this point, though, I think this, what he's talking about here, this Silent Hill game, again, 100% real. So let's read what he said, and then I'll tell you why it's absolutely true. So he says, a Silent Hill leak. There's a lot I'm not sharing for now. This is from a relatively new source for me, but I have been given more than enough proof to believe them. I will also mention the names Anita and Maya, SMS messages, and this is not the only Silent Hill game in development. The shots. Now, let's take a quick intermission break because these four shots were actually taken down. Now, I won't show them either just for the simple fact that they were DMCA'd. And that's a huge part, by the way, of why this is real, okay? Because Konami felt the need to literally protect, <laughs> protect real things that they are in development. So, like, I get it. I get D. Well, I don't like DMCAing, I guess is what I should start off by saying. But I, I would understand, like, them doing it right. It's a leak. They don't want this kind of information getting out there. But by doing that, you just confirmed it's real. So you actually just confirmed it yourself. Uh, and that's a very, it's just a funny self-own, I guess, in a way. Um, he also goes on to say that they're a bit dated from 2020, the, these pictures. So maybe this project looks a bit, a bit different uh, now. But what I'm choosing to share, I know many will doubt this, but I have a lot of private proof to show this is real and as always i will continue to wait on the silent hill game reveal and he actually doubled down later on to other people saying anytime he's ever talked about silent hill it's 100 true now it's easy for you the person that has also said these things to say hey i'm telling the truth every time i've told the thing that doesn't really mean much but i get again what, what, what he's going for now i want to break apart a couple of these things the sms mess like the, the the text messages basically this is a very interesting thing because alana pierce actually uh, kind of confirmed that that's also what she had heard separately i don't think these two were in communication at all and she had basically said what she's heard about a silent hill game is that you're gonna have to sign a waiver or some sort of agreement where the game can actually message you on your phone even when the game is not playing now that is quite a step you know in terms of connecting your life with the game but also you know in a way i don't like that in terms of like the privacy stuff and, and just getting text messages but in another way i think that's actually incredibly incredibly creative and i'm sure it's not the first time i'm sure games back in the day did stuff like that but just the idea that you know a, a game like this a horror game can start to message you <laughs> even when the game is off is haunting <laughs> for sure but uh so i that's another reason i guess to believe him is because that messages it's like well, what's he talking about there? Well, Alana said very, very similar things. This Anita and Maya, I think Anita seems to be the main character, although that could be wrong. One of those two is probably the main character. Um, again, there's there there's solid stuff here. The pictures themselves, by the way, I mean they they just are real. That's the that's the most damning thing to the argument that oh he's just making it up. No, I mean Konami again, they took the pictures down because they are real pictures. So like yeah, it sucks that he had to take them down. Otherwise, his account would have been locked. Actually, his account was locked, and then he had to take the pictures down, and the account was unlocked. But it's like, all right, well, the pictures are absolutely real, so the game is being made. And remember what he says, that this is not the only Silent Hill game in development. He also, actually, he doesn't say it here. There's another uh, bit where he keeps going, where he says it's connected to Sony. I guess I really should have said that earlier on, but here you go now. So this one is a, a Sony, uh, whether it's Sony funded or, you know, whatever's happening, but that's uh, that's a big part of it as well. I think there was a couple other smaller details dropped um, too, but, you know, I guess why that's important is because we've heard, right, the uh, Bloober team, makers of Layers of Fear, right, that's kind of like their biggest thing, uh, they're making a Silent Hill game. That That's a heavy rumor, but that seems to be pretty darn, you know, accurate at this point. So they're making one. I'm not as excited for that one as I would be for this one, simply because this one could still have ties to Kojima. This one does have ties to, uh, to Sony, 
Bluebird team is not the most polished of studios out there in the world. I, I'm sure I'll play that Silent Hill game, but I just don't think it's going to be the better of the two. But gigantic, gigantic. So, you know, I know we've talked about Silent Hill for years. I know that's why people are so skeptical. Like, trust me, I get it. You know what I mean? I get why people are skeptical. I get why people would say, you know, we've heard this forever. I'm just not going to believe it. That's totally cool. But again, and, and really, maybe I would have been saying the same thing if Konami didn't take the pictures down. But because Konami did that, because they issued the DMCA strike against his account, uh, I mean, what you know, what else are you supposed to say? Those were real pictures from a, a real game that's happening. So uh, because of that, I'm inclined to believe everything else that he said about this Silent Hill game. So we'll see. I mean, is it Kojima? Is it coming soon? Is it something we could see at like a PlayStation Showcase? Does it connect to Abandon still? Is there still that possibility? The answers hopefully will be given, <laughs> I mean, this year, right? Is that wishful thinking? Hopefully we can uh, find some of those answers out soon. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Bell icon turn on so you know when all these videos go up. And I hope to see you all on the next video.